Welcome back to another tutorial in Photoshop CS6. Today we're going to be learning how to use pattern overlays. Um, pattern overlays are pretty much uh, the same as color overlays, but it use it, but you use a pattern that you can either import or Photoshop has a couple of them already that you can already use. So uh, let's go ahead and get started. Now I have a, something brought up here, like a custom shape or some text and apply the layer style pattern overlay to it. So the first thing that you want to you'll see is that a pattern has been overlaid on top of your um, layer and we've got our pattern right here. So if you click in the pattern here you can pick different patterns. So we'll stick with the bubbles and then we've got all our different pattern options here. Um, you can pick from other different types of patterns that are in here. Um, you can load patterns and whatnot there. Um, something cool is when you are have your layer style up here, This you can move your pattern around by just clicking and dragging. And then if you need to get it back, you can click on Snap to Origin. And that will bring it back to the center. Oh, sorry. And then um, the next thing that we want to do is uh, check out the blending modes and we can use different blending modes to work with the color that was in the background um, or the color that was on your original layer so this these blue bubbles are being multiplied by the light blue back or light blue color that was in my shape layer at first we've got our opacity here where you can mess with that to blend it in more or make it more transparent and then we got our scale to um, change the scale of the of uh, the pattern. And then um, the last one here is link with layer. And if you check that, it uh, physically links the active pattern with the active layer. So it's always on checked on default, and you can pretty much just leave that on there. So uh, you can always leave that checked if you would like to. So that's all the uh, properties for the pattern overlay. Um, really easy and simple to do. So thanks for watching this tutorial, and I hope you guys learned a lot. So thanks a lot. See you later.